to go to Uzbekistan. It's so exciting. It's the first time. And um, I'm not going alone. My bae is right in front of me, but she doesn't like sitting in <coughs> in a place where there's no windows or something like that. So, and right now is uh, what time is it, bae? Four forty in the morning. I didn't sleep at all. supposed to get there to the airport like around six five yeah six and our flight is at 11 a.m so let's see how that goes i'm scared pretty nervous but excited babe how are you feeling go to Mexico. <laughs> summer. Summer. In summer. We are in the airport. How are you feeling? Good? Excited? Going home? I was talking with my parents in the bus. And what they said? But I couldn't talk really loud. Because so everyone was everybody, sleeping. Yeah. So my mom was like, are you okay? Are you crying? And then my dad was like, why are you crying? Why are you crying? And then drama got unleashed. But I love her. Her parents say, oh, you're going to Russia. But like, I'm from Uzbekistan. We're going to Uzbekistan. <laughs> if it's but not Russia, they're like, oh, have fun in Pakistan. I'm like, it's not Pakistan. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> but that's fine. It's all right. It's forgiven. Just because Uzbekistan was part of Soviet Union. History lesson with Miss Sarina. When when did that happen? Uh, we gained independence in ninety one. Mm. So, but Soviet Union was like fifteen uh, countries together mm. as one. But tourism wasn't so good. You could only travel in Bulgaria and I don't remember exactly, but yeah. But still, it was good. So now many people complain that they want to return to the Union because everything was cheap mm. and it was kind of communism. I don't know how. Communism. It's, yeah. So they had equal rights. So people didn't work, but still they had something to eat. It wasn't fair, I guess. Mm. Someone is working hard, but government is taking it and giving to poor Everybody people. Everybody else. Yeah. yeah. Your first history lesson with Miss Arena is over. I'm sorry I wasn't so good, but next time I will be prepared. Yeah, you're fired. <laughs> You didn't pay me. Uh, I have no money, money. <laughs> anyway, so we have to wait till probably what? Seven? Probably seven. Probably seven. Right now it's almost six ten. Yeah. And six thirteen. Six thirteen. We could like come uh, later, like at five or six, but we don't like to hurry. Like we like to take our time. And there are a lot of Uzbek people, you know, and I better wait inside than here. Then outside, yeah. So, duty we... free. We will see you in the duty free. So, guys, we are already in the plane. And, and uh, it's supposed to be six hours, seven hours. And yeah, hopefully I will record as much as I can. And I will let you guys like see everything here. How it goes. 
So far it's been crazy. We met Kana in the airport. We have to bug him for life. That's it. There's no other explanation. He's stuck with us. He's stuck with us. And um, we will see you guys in a minute. Good morning to our passengers. are very different as you can see I have everything in order right there she has a mess <laughs> so this is her first morning here in Tashkent I am in Sarina's house which is beautiful by the way and I love it I love it for today's video my first two days here and stay tuned for everything else that's gonna happen because a lot of things are gonna happen yes and i hope you like the video and like share and subscribe and we'll see you later <laughs>